everyone and welcome back to another episode of Jurassic World Game, where we have something new coming. There was speculation that possibly Scorpius Rex would be coming, or E750 would be coming to Jurassic World Game, which I feel like it still will. Um, we're just not at the right time for it, apparently. Um, but they have put out this new thing, which shows ready to butt heads, a new creature is ready to knock foes senseless. And if you play Jurassic World Live, you'll know that this is Draco Rex. So the interesting thing, oh not Draco Rex, sorry, Draco Ceratops, that's the one, yes. Uh, but Draco Rex, or Draco Ceratops I should say, is made from Triceratops Gen 2 and Draco Rex. We do actually have a Triceratops Gen 2 in the game. Uh, where there is in the middle there, Triceratops Gen 2. But we don't have a Draco Rex. I don't, do we have a Draco? I don't think we have it. We have a Stiggy Moloch, so it might be a Stiggy Moloch it's made out of. Which would actually make this a really good hybrid. A VIP creature and a tournament hybrid. Pretty baller. But we don't have a Draco Rex. Uh, so it'll be really interesting to see... How we get that? I mean, it could be, it could be the regular Pachycephalosaurus, uh, the rare bear. It could be Pachyceratops, possibly, that'll make the hybrid. Um, maybe even Monostegatops, something like that. Um, but it's, it is just interesting that we know from Dress Live Alive that it should be a Draco Rex, and it's got Draco in the name. But, anyway, anyway, we'll see what happens when that comes. I'm assuming it'll be this week at some point. We'll probably get a tournament, or it'll just be released. If it is a hybrid, because I don't think you get hybrids as tournament creatures. So, we had this. Now, there was a 1% chance of me getting Antarctic Pelter. I spent 1,600 VIP points. Not really fussed whether we get it or not. I mean, I, I would be if we do get it. But it was just like, it's, a, it's an investment. If there's a 1% chance and I do get it, I'll get all my VIP points back. So what did we do? Oh, of course we didn't get it. We got food, and we got DNA. Ah, it, do, it does sting just a little bit, I can't lie. But, I didn't, hopefully it hasn't gone. Yes, it's still here! We have an even better way of getting bucks. If you remember, um, I thought that John Hammond statues were the way to go when it, come, when it came to getting these. And I think you get like 200, or th it was 300 ish I think maybe 300, 200. But this friggin' Apatosaur fossil, apparently, gives me 400 freaking bucks. Oh, hey. So it looks like not only you know you can actually have a, and maybe there's other ways. Maybe a Padasaur might be the better decoration to just have in your lot ready to trade up. I mean, there it is. You can get a million for it, which I guess isn't too bad. We'll trade a Labyrinthodontia for some DNA. It just speeds up and I'm not going to trade that for that, but I will trade food for VIP points as well. So we are getting closer and closer to 20,000 here. Uh, we do have some daily missions, of course. <laughs> Let's collect those. Um, I think we might have j yeah, it's just refreshed this, I think. So we've got two days. I would have oh no, this was last night, actually. Ah. So we have 2,000 and odd boss DNA. It's still not really anywhere near... Oh, that was good! 90 bucks there and some super DNA. What? That was like the best pack you could have ever got. Wow, that was amazing. I did not expect to get that. Oh. Okay, well, since we're here, may as well just do some regular sort of uh, missions. But I do want to do the boss thing, and we do need to get some packs. I'll see what the, the situation is, and whether or not um, this Draco Rex is going to be out today, or maybe later this week. I'm not too sure. It's probably going to be later this week, since we've just got the teaser now. I would assume, anyway. So I'll collect this mod, and that'll do another mission, another one. I haven't actually been doing this game too often. Uh, you probably realize there'll be some people like, where is it? It's been like ages. Because there really isn't a great deal uh, for me to do. I think apart from like maxing up certain creatures. Oh, we got a free speed of heck. Yeah, let's do that. I'll take you a Therese and a source, which I just instantly sell anyway. Brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't even get to places. Um, so VIP exclusive events. Yeah, they're regular. Let's have a look. What have we got coming? 27 days, 22 hours. You'll have a dino box, which you don't really care about. Um, but so far, in two days, it's, at least this hybrid's not going to be... It's probably just going to be released. I, I'd, I'd assume it's just going to be released. Uh, it's not going to be one of these. Oh, it's a tournament thing. Unless it is. Unless it's its own species. But we know it's a hybrid. So, from Dress World Live. Which will be interesting to see what they do. But anyway, we got this. The ultimate objection. The ominous engagement. And the ominous engagement. Okay, both ominous. So, let's have a look at the prizes. So, you've got the platinum prize for that one. You've got... Ooh, regular for that. Ooh, the regular for that as well. So we may as well do ultimate objection. Now we're gonna do one 
it honestly makes more sense to go for Omega. I think maybe the Juggernaut could be pretty interesting when it comes to, um, uh, like, health. Because in this, you know, the more creatures you face up against, the more health you lose. And, you know, the health the attack it's going to have is probably over 2,000, especially for the early stages. That's still going to kill everything. However, it is a herbivore. And a carnivore and herbivores are the most plentiful. Um, and if you're herbivore, you're going to face a lot of carnivores, which isn't good. But if you're carnivore... You're kind of sword because you're not <laughs> neutral to carnivores and you get a bonus against herbivores. And here you go. So if it was friggin' Juggernaut or whatever first, uh, this, I mean, yeah, I, I, if we're going to take any damage, at least it would have been like an extra 50%. This way it's not. Um, I mean, we'll see. Well, I think you get one chance to do this, though. You got one chance. So, we'll, well, I mean, we'll just go for as many hits as we can. Just try and get through this as quickly as possible. Um, at least the start of it. Capra Sutures doesn't have much attack anyway. Even with the 50% increase, it's only 66 attack. <gasps> 66 even, yes. Beaver beams, beaver beams. There you go. Is that from Lady in the Tramp or something like that? Did they meet a beaver in Lady in the Tramp? I think they do. I think that's where the 66 comes from. <laughs> I should know this beaver. Beaver logic, beaver knowledge. Okay, so we'll go for... I'll, I'll go for three. I mean, I'm expecting... Oh, I was expecting two. I was not expecting three. That's because I was expecting it. That's why. I was expecting it, therefore. It was like, no. <laughs> oh, right. There you go. I'll do three again. That's more like it, yes. I want to get that platinum. I don't think I've ever won that platinum. What is even in the platinum? I mean, of course, it'll be like tournament creatures, I think. I think it's probably only tournament creatures that are in there. Ooh, a decent hit. 600. Aye, that's not so good. I think that was... Uh, I'll just go for that. Yeah, I know. I think he would have definitely had one block, and he did. But maybe he had more? Did he just put those in reserve? Did he? Yeah, he did. He could have full-on blocked me there. Wow, okay. So 200 now. Oh my god! Ooh, 2,500! And what are we on? 14? Okay, that's dangerous. Ooh, that was a lot of damage for just, like, at the low level we're at the moment. Oh, no. There's a, look at the bracket. So, so tall. And it's like, I've got to fit in this screen. <laughs> um, we're in a bit of a dangerous situation here um, because we're against a Mastodonosaurus. And you know what? I'd rather do this. I'd rather, you know, you can full on block me. Go for two, go for three, go for four, even. Uh, two, yeah. I'd rather have three or four. Um, so what I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna just wait out this Brachiosaur because I saw how much it, the Darwin Optus or whatever it was did to me. Mastodonosaurus with the 50% bonus. I don't want to find that out. So we're gonna wait here. We're gonna hang on here just for a little bit. I mean, it is only level one. It is a VIP creature though, which are way better than tournament creatures, which is what we're facing at the moment. So if it goes to six, I'll be really happy. Five is good too. Three is not good. Three is kind of annoying because it could have seven on the next go. I guess five, six, seven. It's still only hitting me with three. Um, okay, it's got six. Still attacking numbers. Come on. I think I've only ever done this once. I think I've only ever won once. And already we took like a massive hit right away. Even before we've hit the 50% mark. So I'm not holding my breath here. <laughs> I'm really not holding my breath at this point. Shouldn't have, I shouldn't have let myself open. That's what I shouldn't have done. But look at this. Like, I, it was, I couldn't even have done an educated guess. Because look at what we're facing with this Brachiosaur. Has had ample opportunity to go full out, but it hasn't. Yet the other one, the previous one, did. Maybe the bot knew. Apparently the bot knows if you've got loads of block or if you don't. Because if you do put loads of block in, it doesn't go for any attack. I think it's on four again. No, it's on six. Okay, please go for six. Go, don't go for two. Don't go for two. Four. Okay, you know what? I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. The possibility of a two block. So one, one, two, one, two. And max I get hit by... Yeah, max I'm going to get hit by here is two, which is still like a thousand damage, which is a lot. But we're going to be on gold. I think we're definitely going to get the gold. Okay. You know what? You've got a possibility of three block. I kill you in one, one, two. I'm going to go for that. I think you wouldn't have went for three. Oh, why did you go for three block? Come on. No. Draco Rex has got a lot of attack as well, I think. Oh, bugger off. Really? Really? We're doing this? Okay, I'm going to risk it. I'm going to risk it. I'm going for four reserve, two block. 
So he could hit me with four here, which would be devastating. But they never do. Okay, that's fine. I'll take the two hit. I'll take the two hit if it means that I kill you. So we will factor in the extra two block here. Um, you know what? That's not too bad. And of course he didn't go for the full two block. Of course he didn't. Of course they didn't. Why would they? Why would they want to? Okay, so he's got five. 140. Oh, two, two herbivores. Oh, beautiful. Yes. Yes, please. I think Parasaur's probably got less attack than you. But you know what it is. I'm just going to stall here for a second. Uh, so we've got three block. So that's three attacks it can hit me with. Which is nothing. Oh, it's nothing. You know what? Oh, look at that. It's good. It's good. It's good. But I tell you what, he won't. He won't freaking give me an opening though. I bet you. I bet you. Go on. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? You got six again? Go on. Just go for six. Go for four. Go for five. Six is great, but five. five. Can we get it? Can we get it? I'll take that. I'll take that. So, there we go. There we go. Doesn't matter what happens here. We kill them. Brilliant. More of that, please. So, what's the attack? Oh, it's got more. Okay. Okay. Then, ooh, it's going to be a lot. It's going to be a lot to get the platinum here. And Tani, Tani Calagrius is a carnivore. This is tricky. This is really tricky, this one. Go for two? Like, like, oh no. No. I mean, I'm going to keep on doing this. I'm going to keep on doing this. Hopefully, after the t the, this carnival that's coming up, Tani Calagria, so Calagrius, um, there's not much. Oh, really? Okay, well, it's, it's all right. Yeah, perfect. Yeah. Patience will be rewarded, my child. So one, two, one, two, and then four. He's only got one block, and he does go for it as well. Brilliant. Okay, so 200. Oh, that's a, it's the patchy. I think it's the patchy after this. Or is it? Yeah, I think it is. Okay, so out of his four, he went for one. You know what? I'm going to factor in two here. I'm going to do that. I'm going to factor in two block. Yes, here we go. Come on. Oh, we, oh, we need to get to gold. That's right. You need to get to up to the top to get unlock gold. And then we'll need to do it again. So it's five and five. Okay, okay. Now, the, the pecky eyes. Yeah, um... Pretty, pretty scary, but I'll go for two just in case. You, you know, I would have been happy to take that. I would have, but here we go. Here we go. This is this is a bit deadly now. Seven is crazy. Oh, that's not bad. That's okay. Three blocks, four reserves. Five, five. That's what I flashed up. Oh, brain no work going too good now. Having to use it. Right, come on. Go for four. Three is good. Two. Two. Do you think that's risky? Uh, you know what? I'll go for it. I'll go for it. So one, two, and there we go. There we go. There we go. We definitely killed him. Definitely killed him. He's got five. So maxing in hitters was four. Let's see, shall we? Let's see. Um, ooh, that might be killer. That might be killer. Oh, ooh, it's close. I'm only on 3,000 health here. I'm only on 3,000. Okay, now we're going to be hit by two. Come on, at least we can get a gold least get the call. Okay, so three out of six. Right. Okay. So one, one, two, three, one, and one, two, three. I think that, that'll do. Yes! Oh, perfect! So they've only got four and this is weak to me, so a 200. Oh, and then an Ichthyostega. It's like, because I could easily do this. Oh, brilliant! <laughs> Bloody brilliant! So, I could easily get a goal. I could easily finish off the, uh, or carefully finish off this guy, the Uniosaurus, or Uneosaurus, and then kill Ichthyostega with a full-on attack, and then just leave myself up to the mercy of whatever's next. But if I feel like there's a chance that I'm able to go for the Platinum, like if it's herbivore after herbivore after herbivore, maybe. So I'm going to be hit by three, and <laughs> not four, three. Uh, okay, okay. Oh, it's, it's not it's not good enough. I think he'll probably go for full-on three block here. And if I expend myself, which I would have had to have done, uh, which is go for four. Uh, maybe that could have been good, actually. Maybe that could... Uh, you know what? Even better. Even better here. Um, one, one, two, one, two, three. And just in case, I'm playing it safe here. In case he didn't go for those blocks, which he did. But it does mean that Ichthyostega can only go for one here. Uh, one hit straight through. And if he does go for full-on four attack, that's kind of good for me. Uh, that not so much. Um, or do I risk it? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to even this out. I'm going to go for three block, three reserve, even it out. I could have went for four reserve and two block. 
but then I would have been hit by three and that definitely would have killed me. This way, I've definitely survived. And oh, that would have killed me. Oh, that would have killed me. Ooh. Okay, okay. So one, one, two, three. And hopefully, you Tyrannus doesn't have 1,000 attack. Okay, and there's a Brachiosaur. Oh, what? I only need to kill two? Woo! We're gonna be- Oh, wait, there's, there's one higher, is there? There's one higher. Oh, uh, one, two, one, two, three. And I think that's- Oh, Brachiosaur's gonna be nerfed down to- Yes, I can survive two hits from this. Oh, this is close. Go for four. Go for it. Three's good too. Okay, okay. She's got one block. One, two, one, two, three. Oh, please go for the block. Yes! Okay, I don't think Acrocanthosaurus can kill me in one hit. Oh my god, this is it! This is it! We're about to do it! Go for four. Okay. What do we do here, guys? I'm, I'm just gonna do that. I think if he's got six, he can kill me. Oh, he can kill me. No! No! Come on! We were so close. No! Ah! Oh, almost made it. Almost made it. The Havoc League. What's the best prize we can get from Havoc League? Legendary Twins at 2%. Um, doesn't give any bucks, unfortunately, which is a bit of a shame. But you know what? That wasn't too bad. We almost did it. I'll take some boss DNA. I'd rather have that. Or 200 VIP points. You know what? I'll take that as well. 200 VIP, VIP points for an entry of... I don't even know what the entry was. It's probably some bucks. Probably wasn't worth it. But you know what? We did good there. That was pretty decent. I was... I was... Oh. If I blocked for five... Oh, man. We may have been able to do it. If I buck for full on five, uh, and he went for six, and it would have done me one damage, I would have went for one attack and then three block, and then it would have been up to the Ankylosaur. If the Ankylosaur did 500 damage to me at half attack, at level whatever it was, which I don't think it would have, I might have been able to do that. Oh, excuse me. Oh, no, that could have been it. That could have been it, man. Because uh, I would have went for a full-on four. We went, whatever, just go for four attack. Just go for four attack. Because I don't think they ever blocked for four. If they did, it was like once or twice. <gasps> that was so close. I can't believe that. Damn. Damn. Oh, well. It is what it is. It is what it is. Okay, so we did... Oh, complete two co-90s. Another 18 for that. I'm saving my super DNA. Because I'd rather unlock a dinosaur than max it up. Because at the moment... We got a level 28 Juggernaut, which I am kind of all right with. And um, where's the Tyrandon? Oh, well, that, there's that. Oh, there he is. Okay, he mustn't fit here. Yeah, he mustn't be able to fit. A level 19 Valkyrie. Ah, uh, it, it, it's a tricky one. It is a tricky one. I was hoping to win a card pack there. But with 2%, I'm now wondering what the chances were of getting the 100 VIP points or winning VIP points. It's probably, like, really high. If, if winning the best pack was 2%, it was probably really high. Although, I'd rather have got the VIP points than an Alasaur. So, again, like I said, there's always look on the bright side. Always look on the bright side of life. Come on, go leave me. Oh, it's one of these, is it? It's really low. Really low. But I'm still getting towards that freaking Ankylosaur super DNA. I will get that. I need 2,000 in order to unlock it. It's not like I really need it. But every little helps. There you go. Complete the ult. Oh, so just completing it gives you VIP points. Beast of Biodome. Uh, Earth Shattering. VIP. Earth Shattering. Clash of Titans. Okay, so it was just that one. Because the other ones are ominous engagements. And I think that's okay. I, I, I didn't see any VIP points for that. So you need to kind of do that one. Oh, open three car packs, do battle arenas. So keep an eye out on this space. See if we get it. I know I didn't get the other, um, the other, whatever it was. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I think it was a, it was an amphibious. It may have been an aquatic uh, tournament creature. That was the platycarapus. That was it. But 
Uh, actually, I'm, every weekend so far in August, I've been doing something. And of course, that's when it came out. And I was just too knackered by the time I came back on Sunday to do it. And unfortunately, that's the way the cookie crumbles sometimes. And oh, <laughs> although this time, I, if it is Draco or whatever, I will do it. I will just put in the hours. I will do it. I promise, guys. I promise. Don't leave. Don't leave. Until next time, guys. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like. And I'll see you cutie viewer babies later. Oh, bye-bye.